Ancient Egyptians are credited with inventing candy, so it's only fitting that an Egyptian namesake city like Memphis has its own history with sweets. And tonight's five-star story about the people, places, and things that make us proud to call the Mid-South home, we will have you feeling like a kid in a candy store, literally. Kim Clark takes you to the candy mecca that is Wayne's Candy Company. Wayne's Candy Company, just off South Main, on the corner of East Carolina Avenue and 2nd Street, has been part of the Memphis landscape for 76 years. Walk inside and prepare to be amazed. We see this a lot. They'll walk in the door, especially with our novelty shelf and all the colors, the kids especially. They'll walk in, they'll stop, they'll freeze, they'll kind of do like this. I've seen it a thousand times. Wow, <laughs> you like that. Showroom shelves filled with more than 2,000 types of candy and novelties, and not just your average everyday stuff either. Well, you know, we have a lot of old school stuff, nostalgia stuff like the candy cigarettes, and got to call them candy sticks now. But anyway, we have Chico sticks and a lot of old school stuff. We have snowball juice, and we have all kinds of novelties, gators and monkeys and little basketball goals and stuff like that. Gary Wilkes is company president and the son of the man who started it all, Wayne Wilkes. Dad hitchhiked from Arkansas back in the 1930s. He had a dime, and so they stopped at a restaurant, and he bought the truck driver a cup of coffee for a nickel, and he got one for a nickel, so he was broke. He walked over to my uncle's house and lived with him, and he borrowed $60 and put $40 down on a real crummy truck, and then he bought $20 worth of cookies, and he sold those and then bought $22 worth of cookies, and that's how he started. Eventually, Gary's dad was able to buy $3,000 worth of these then 50 cent cans of hard candy, using the profits to then buy his first building. By 1946, Wayne's Candy Company was officially in business and soon after moved to its current location. Kelly Hardcastle is Wayne's grandson. As far as uh, wholesale candy companies with a cash and carry, we, I, I would venture to say we've probably been here the longest. There's also more than sweet treats inside the candy wholesalers building. Because we've got four different pickle companies, pickles. Wow. And all the, the pig's feet, pickled eggs, hot sausage, we sell a lot of that. Nacho sliced peppers, whole jalapeno peppers. We even have okra in a half gallon. You might even find an item or two that was too good of a deal for Wilkes to pass up, like these University of Memphis shirts on sale for $12.95. That was just kind of the spur of moment thing we got a hold of. Wayne's Candy is truly a family business. And then my wife worked down here and my daughter and brother and sister and my nephew is my boss now. And we got we have great employees. We treat them. We have uh, we have a long-term relationship with many of our employees. We've had some here for excess of 30 years, and so we 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 look at it as family, more than just a boss and an employee. You know, we all we all pitch in and do whatever it takes. There's plenty of work to be done since the candy warehouse not only welcomes people into the store but also ships goods to businesses throughout Tennessee, Mississippi, Missouri, and Arkansas. And then we'll have large wholesalers come in and buy stuff for their business, and, and they might buy uh, uh, two or 3,000 pounds. The hours can be long, not to mention the amount of walking involved with the massive warehouse behind the showroom. Early hours. Get up early, get down here early. Uh, it's, it's tough work. We got a 30,000 square foot warehouse. Even still, both Wilkes and Hardcastle agree. This has been a great blessing from God. It just really has. My granddad saw a future in doing this and started a long time, and it's been so great for our family and for so many others. It's a neat thing to come to work. And you know, you're selling candy. I mean, you know. Wayne's Candy Company, bringing sweet delight to thousands throughout the decades, makes us proud to call this place home. Kim Clark, Action News 5. So you might be wondering what's in store for the future of Wayne's Candy Company. Well, there's at least one grandson working with the business right now, so they're not planning to go anywhere anytime soon. For more information about Wayne's Candy Company, click on the link with this story at actionnews5.com.